I'm loving the pink. Thank you so much. It feels apropos for the power of women, you know? The power of women. It's a little power pink moment. How does it feel to be in this room tonight? It's always insane. Yeah. This is my third time coming, and I always sit at my table and just sort of pinch myself. In I'm like, awe. why do I get to be here? It's so cool. Why do I get to be here? All of these incredible women doing these incredible things in the world, and I get to bear witness to it and be inspired by it. Because you're a powerful woman. That's why you're here. Well, okay. Okay. I mean, when you think of the word powerful women, who comes to mind for you? Oh, gosh. Oprah? I mean, yep, yep, yep. Reese Witherspoon? Um, I mean, there's so, there's so many. Where do I even? Carol Burnett, I cannot. Oh my cannot gosh, and she's here dying. tonight, come on. Is she one of your idols? I just love her so much. My first dream role was to play Annie. Oh, and it was my, good. yes, and it was my first thing I ever, in a community theater production of Annie was my first it. leading role. I, I got it. to play Annie and her Miss Hannigan will, iconic. I mean, iconic, 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 iconic. I want to know, what advice do you have for young actresses who are trying to break into this industry, be on a hit show like you were, you know? What advice do you have for them when it comes to navigating this strange, crazy, oh. beautiful world? This world is so crazy. I think, I mean, I've given this advice so many times. It's to be grounded, to have truth tellers, surround yourself with truth tellers who know you, who value you outside of whatever success you might or might not have, because this career takes you on these epic waves. It is fleeting. Fly up, and it's gone in a second. You can feel the most secure you've ever felt in a job and then it's gone, right. you know? Right. And to be able to stay grounded and be like, that is not a reflection on my identity and my self-worth. Right. This is just the game. And even if it ends, it has nothing to do about your skills or no. your talent no. or how much you love your job. It's not no. that. No, and, and learning that when those doors close, that's, it's just a redirection. It's not a rejection, I you know? I always say those things don't happen to you, they happen for you. I... I'm that's gonna, Oprah. I have chills. That I have Oprah. chills, and that's exactly how I feel. 100%. I love it.